My hopes were very low, but I just decided to Google RTX 3000 Disable VRAM, and to my surprise, modded VBIOSes with disabled memory channels for RTX 3000 series GPUs actually exist. Just like the diagnostic tools that we used, I'm pretty sure that these VBIOSes are only available because of that NVIDIA leak that we mentioned earlier, which ethically sucks, but I just want to see what happens, man. So I rebooted my Testbench PC back into Windows and downloaded the archive full of those VBIOSes. Using NVFlash, another piece of leaked NVIDIA software, I dumped the factory VBIOS for safekeeping and for when I decide to properly repair that card. I crossed my fingers and flashed the 3070 BIOS with memory channel B disabled. When it rebooted, I ran straight to Device Manager. And just like that, Code 43 was gone. Well, another code briefly appeared in its place, but that was just related to drivers. It went away on its own. Windows Update retrieved the NVIDIA drivers, and Device Manager finally reported that the device was working properly. And if we check Task Manager, our RTX 3070 now reports only having 6 gigs of usable VRAM instead of 8. On the 3070, each of the four memory channels are made up of two 1 gig VRAM chips, so losing 2 gigs of VRAM is expected with this fix, as we disabled one whole memory channel, which was 2 gigs of VRAM. And just like that, the card is operational again. We did have to sacrifice some VRAM to get to this point, but we obviously have the option to replace the damaged VRAM chip down the road and reflash the original VBIOS to reclaim those 2 gigs back, which is something I do plan on doing eventually. But until then, my friends got a working GPU again, and it was relatively easy to accomplish all things considered. If you want to watch me fix and mod more stuff in the future, please consider subscribing. Thanks for watching.